Hello and welcome this is Hasan Shah and you're watching News 47 On 14th of September 2020 another black day was registered in the history of Indian democracy A 19 year old dalit woman was brutally raped and murdered by four upper caste men in UP Hathras The body was cremated a while after 3 am on Wednesday The family of the victim was not even allowed to perform the last rites of their daughter The victim's father and mother were pleading and crying with heavy pain in front of the UP police and authorities. But the ambulance took away the body somewhere else. The victim's body was forcefully cremated by UP police even without the presence of a family. The family was not even allowed to perform the last rituals which is a basic right. And no explanation is being given behind the event which took place. The relatives of the victim claimed that they were locked up at home and were not allowed to go out. This event has spread a huge boil of outrage across the country. Why was the event carried out like this? There are allegations on UP police that they are trying to protect the accused. Is the UP police trying to hide something? What gives the estate administration the right to do so? Every question is left unanswered. The four men who have been accused are Sandeep who is 22 years old and is the main accused and is believed to have enmity with the family of the victim and other one is Love Kush who is 19 years old Ram Kumar is 28 years of age and Ravi who is 28 years old as well All these person have been accused for the crime which took place and they have been arrested Congress President Rahul Gandhi was stopped in the Yamuna Expressway by police while he was on his way to pay visit to the family of the victim. While Rahul Gandhi was in an argument with the police and was questioning the police that why is he not allowed to go and under which article of the law is the police arresting him. The police got physical with him and wrong use of power was being witnessed and clearly violation of the rules of democracy was also being witnessed.